first day of my life. I'm glad I didn't die before I met you. I'm sorry, I'm singing. I know I'm bad. I just didn't know how to answer when you asked me what song made me think of us. And it was that one. And no, this is not a suicide poem, but damn. I am really glad I didn't die before I met you. That song made me believe in fortune telling, palm readings. A couple years ago, I stood in line in the baking Vegas heat on first Friday, waiting to have my palm read, hoping someone else can make sense of myself. And as I showed her my palm, she said, your heart line is really long. And I scoff because fuck, tell me something I don't know, please. I love fast, quickly, and it doesn't matter if you're my enemy or acquaintance, I probably love you. And then she said, but that line is so long, it's falling off your sleeve, reaching everyone else but yourself. And I can tell someone loves you, but they just aren't ready yet. And I laugh because most of my life has been comprised of poor timing, friendships meant to just be friends, and me loving someone who does not love me back. That night, I listened to the song. Six months later, you and I are in a club in Denver, stuck between dancing with each other, dancing with the group, and standing still. We end up standing still, letting the promiscuous music speak for us, and every day after, I listen to the song. Starting to realize that maybe things are supposed to be steady. Maybe when you love someone, it feels like an epiphany, until it's just an overwhelming relief, until it's just how things have always been. After the club, nothing happens. We're about to leave for Christmas, and we're on the couch. We've drank half a bottle of whiskey, and not even liquid courage can get me to face you. And you're going to bed, and the silence in the room is an invitation. I decline with a hug, and our, in the, and our faces inappropriately close together, and we know what could happen, but it doesn't yet. Hmm. Almost a year after the palm reading, it happens, and the song finally makes sense, and here I am thinking I had to fix my heart line before loving you before you could love me, and though I am embarrassingly broken, it's okay, and I will always share our story and what reminds me of our story because I don't ever want to forget the moments. I don't ever want to forget the time it took and your patience and the faith I had to have in a bright eye song, palm readings, and fortune time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't ever want to forget the first day of my life. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Yeah.